Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Nyesam Wike landed in Port Harcourt, the river state capital on Saturday, Wike entered the city despite warnings and threats from some loyalists of Governor Simi Fubara not to step into the state, Honorable Boma Goodhead, a member of the House of Representatives, representing Akuku slash Aseri Toru Federal Constituency and other protesters had dared Wike to step into river state again. They vowed never to fold their hands and watch the former governor pocket river state, we are here to tell Ahmed Bola Tanyubu to call Wike to order because the next time he comes into River State to disturb the peace of the state will not fold our hands and watch, Wike should come to River State and we'll show him what it means to hold River State. We dare you, come back to River State again if you're a man, Goodhead had warned. However, Wike landed in River State in company of Senator Barry Mpiji, Senator Alwell Aniasa, Minister of State, Petroleum, Heineken Lkpabiri, Rivers Assembly members and some local government area chairmen. Fubro presses the nuclear button, orders Rivers commissioners nominated by Wike to resign. Rivers State Governor Simi Fubro has all commissioners nominated by his predecessor, Nyesam Wike, to submit their resignation letters. This move comes amid an escalating power struggle between the two political heavyweights, with the rift expanding to encompass the state's top government officials. Nine commissioners known to be loyal to Wike have already resigned from Fubro's cabinet, marking a significant development in the ongoing political saga. Huber's directive, issued on Friday morning, sets a deadline for the remaining commissioners. The political maneuvering between Fubra and Wike has led to a series of resignations within the government, with 18 commissioners tendering their resignations on the specified Friday. The situation has prompted speculations of a broader system cleansing. Governor Fubra has also floated a live band in the wake of the political crisis in the state. Fubra's live band came alive shortly after his speech during the flag off of the construction of 20,000 housing units in the Ikora area of the state. The live band was heard singing, Day your day make I day my day, nobody worry nobody, to the excitement of the crowd. Fubra's new live band is coming on the heels of the political tension ravaging the state. Recall that Fubra's predecessor and FCT minister, Nyesam Wike's live band as governor of River was led by gospel artist, Bamidili Abiyadik, also known as Sensational Bamidili, sang Igbo-themed music. The band is known for singing soothing songs for Wike, with its infamous as Day Pain Dem, E Day Sweet Us song, Bamdal said his songs are usually motivated by happenings around an event and the mood of the governor. Simi Fubra from the Aja Nationality Extraction, is a distinguished Nigerian politician and accomplished accountant, currently holds the esteemed position of executive governor of River State. His political journey reached a pinnacle in 2023 when he secured victory on the platform of the People's Democratic Party PDP, succeeding Nyesam Wike in this significant role. Before assuming the governorship, Fubra served diligently as the accountant general of River State, showcasing his expertise and commitment to public service.